what is the mission of mathematics nowadays? How can people think of mathematics for themselves? Here is a very small group which intends to create mathematics from real world, not from mathematics itself. The name of this center is Mathematical Modeling and Data Science. People here are strongly convinced that mathematical modeling is achieved correctly only by knowing real world based on data science. Then, role of mathematics will be to connect real world with cyberspaces. I started my academic career as a peer mathematician. As I remember, many topics were reformulated in the context of an equation from which amazing, unbelievable things emerged continuously. Several years later, there came the first plateau. Any problems on hands looked to be reduced to the same question on which I was captured for a long while. One day, the other came on me of a beautiful structure of the question of its own regardless whether I were able to solve it or not. That was a symmetry, which was noticed once all the problems troubled me were resolved already. Here is a strange example of the similarity between pure mathematics and real world. My feeling is that something the same always appears in mathematics, physics, chemistry, and biology. The age will certainly come when artificial intelligence joins the study of pure mathematics. Here I remember an old movie delivered from the United States titled AI. At the last part of this movie, an alien talks to a robot, which he found many years after the extinction of mankind. I often feel a sort of envy of human beings of that thing they call spirit. Human beings had created a million explanations of the meaning of life in art, in poetry, and mathematical formulas. Certainly, human beings must be the key to the meaning of existence. This is a feeling I really met in my research life. Then, what is the difference between human beings and AI? Engineering or biology may provide answers. I'm studying a human-robot interactions and developing various interactive robots. Especially, I'm creating a very human-like robot. So, very human-like robot they can be a very important test bed for understanding humans. What human is? This is the most important question for us. By using a very human-like robot, we are trying to understand meta-level cognitive function by humans. But of course, we can find the practical application of robots, interactive robots. I believe in near future, that we're going to use a more interactive robot in our daily life, and the robot will help us. Eradication of cancer is the ultimate goal of human beings. Recently, innovation of cancer therapy, such as immunotherapy, has been made to develop Next generation cancer therapy, we have to analyze the collapse of intercellular interactions in organs that result in the onset and development of cancer. However, the analysis of huge data of interaction networks is beyond the conventional biology. We believe that we could achieve such innovation with mathematical oncology. Huge data are open via internets, and biologists are encouraged to undertake data-driven modeling. To create theory, biology follows the logic, using even the argument of contradiction. Research process of biology, thus, obeys a similarity to that of pure mathematics, particularly in the proof of theorems. Very near in future, somewhat different research styles may reach outstanding biological theories, which lead to a fusion of mathematics and basic medical science. Surprisingly, the elements in pure mathematics are essential modules in mathematical modeling in biology. The ultimate purpose is to reproduce all the biological events inside the computer vision. Our center delivers mathematics to biologists as a fundamental concept for creating their theory.